Ready? All right, here we are back in Montreal at the Bell Center, and with, and with respect to all of the MMA fans globally around the world, for my money, this is the loudest venue I have ever heard for a UFC live. If they say that the United Center is the home that MJ built, this is George St. Pierre's home, the Bell Center in Montreal. And I'm telling you, man, when the hometown boy hits the curtains, these people go crazy. This is a phenomenal fight, Brian. Really making good use of his reach advantage there with that punch. Just unable to quite find that range. Lee gets hit with a kick. That one appeared to land flush. There's no give on that leg kick. Timely defense there, huge block for him. That one snuck in, nice strike. Under three minutes now to go on the round. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, just misses with the kick. Right on the button. Liver kick. Oh, and there's a kick to the body, not having that one blocked by Lee. Go, 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 one minute. Unable to land the head kick there. Big Paul punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Oh, man. This is one thing you, you do not want to get kicked in the head. Now. You cannot take too many of those head kicks. But this guy gets his leg up there so fast, sometimes you don't see it coming. Time the shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things. Whoa! Fight the score. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. Ready? All right, so after he landed a high number of kicks in the previous round, we'll see if he can keep it going here as our next round gets underway. He should stay the course. He's so educated with his legs and his feet that he's given his opponent a very difficult time trying to anticipate what's coming his way. Oh, blocks the shot. <laughs> trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may flow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Well, you saw us reference it in the tail of the tape, DC. He's got the reach advantage and certainly made good use of it there in landing that jab. Just missed on the front kick there. Wow, that's a huge shot right there, DC. You don't want to have too many more of those. No, and he needs to start looking at the finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Nice job there to land the knee strike to the body, again making great use of his length in this match. 
man, as he landed a high volume of strikes here in round two, definitely picking up the pace after round one. So he got the message from the corner, and now he is taking control of this second round. Nice punch lands over the top. It's very tricky when he throws that body kick. How about that chin? Start to see some of the damage cut underneath that right eye. Oh, he tagged him with the punch there, DC. That's an educated left hand. He's got great timing with his left hand. Oh, he heard a bat with a jab. That shot blocked by Lee. Nice shot to the body there. Well, he's looking for that left hand, just out of range, though, with it. Starting to do some really significant damage to the body here. Another strike lands there. Good stick. Look at him chopping the woods. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Real nice body kick land. 15 seconds remain in the round. Big kick land. Round three next. All right, let's get you a replay from that previous round. It was the big knockdown courtesy of that kick that, that nearly closed the show for good. It almost closed the show, but nothing's more discouraging than when you get somebody hurt that bad and you don't shut the door. He has to go back to work now knowing that he's got about as tough a guy as, if, as he's ever had in front of him in the octagon tonight. You ready? You ready? Fight! Huge block there. Lee gets caught with that punch. Got to shore up the defense here. Well, he hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. He continues to connect on a high volume of strikes here. Gosh, the taller fighter lands a knee, and Daniel Cormier to my right, I can hear him saying, I wish I was a little bit small. Nice body kick. Man, look at the redness starting to appear on the left side of his body. His opponent would be wise to continue to attack there. Well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. Oh, that's a good right hand. Oh, man, his leg kicks are outstanding, and you saw a great example of that just there. And you see his opponent starting to slow down. He cannot take many of those kicks. Out of range with that kick attempt. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Look at how he turned the hip into that leg kick. Oh, wow! Huge head kick. Oh, and he lands yet another flush knee. That's going to leave him hard. And again, when you're using this length as effectively as he is here tonight, we might get a finish here in the not-too-distant future. Good punch, Lance. Right to the target. Let's see if his opponent can survive. I cannot believe he is still standing after taking that punch. Trying to establish that jab once again. Able to check the high kick. That's a big strike right there. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace 
and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Kick to the body now. That one won't land. And that'll do it. 15 minutes in the books. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. You ready? You ready? Fight! Big left hook coming, it's blocked. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. Stay busy. You control this. Over and over, he landed a big body kick. Lee gets caught with that punch. Much improved defensively as he blocks the shot. would have to be classified as a mess. Cut on his cheek, and it's only getting worse. Big kick land. So once again, leaning on that long reach as he counters effectively with a jab to the head. Timing his shots nicely here, champ. He's doing a great job of mixing everything up and using a lot of diverse strikes. Oh, an educated jab there. I can watch. Shot there, DC, and one more of those, he might be out. I mean, the fight is going to be over. I can't believe he's still standing. That shot landed perfect. A beautiful punch. Nice defense there, huge block. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Lands the elbow, that should leave a mark. Still unable to find that precise range with the high kick. Punch over the top. Such a fast leg kick. Just missed with the left there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Oh, oh, you don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. Real sneaky body kick. Horn sounds for the end of round four. All right, so a huge round for him there. Nearly had him out of there with the head kick. Did get the knockdown. Talk us through the replay. He got the knockdown. He won the round. He did everything correct. The only thing he didn't do is finish the fight. But if he continues down the path, if he continues to do the exact same thing as he did before, he will get that finish. So here it is, folks, fifth and final round. Oh, here's the head kick, it's blocked. Nice punch by Lou. And he caught the kick. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Wow, he lands another leg kick. Moving to the top of this 
fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high with his opponent, got up or low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Oh, big roundhouse attempt just misses. Now to go in the fight. Not there. Big body kick man. Blocks the shot. Nice strike. Back and forth we go. Try to establish that jab. One minute to go in the fight. Oh, DC, he is officially rough. A big, massive hook that really has put his opponent on skates. Oh, beautiful jab there, man. It's like you know what's coming, can't stop it. I mean, you have to anticipate that jab coming or he will batter and bruise you with that single strike. Kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. What a fight! All right, so as we await the judges' scorecards, DC will look back at his handiwork. He had it all going from a striking standpoint tonight. Man, he did a great job. It was very entertaining to watch someone be in such a great state of flow, a great flow state in regards to the stand-up. He said that tonight we would be very impressed with his performance, and I am thoroughly impressed.